It's such an honor. There is so much talent in the room. I'm just so impressed with uh, the people I've met, the speakers I've heard this weekend. Um, and it's uh, what I'm going to do for you now, I think, what I'm going to try to do is summarize some of the high points of what's happened this weekend as I present to you some fresh content on perhaps the most valuable lesson of the weekend. I know you got technical advice this weekend. I know you got uh, professional advice. I know you got consulting. Donald was helping you with succession planning. The number one thing we all need is better relationships because relationships make the world go round, baby. Action shot. This is Bob Neiman from Planet Laundry Magazine. It's also been a pleasure working with him. The entire team, really. Nika Thomas, I've worked with. Uh, Danielle, I think, most closely in the association. But I just have so many friends at CLA, and, uh, and it was so much nice connecting with all of you this weekend. Uh, I also enjoyed the speakers very much. A round of applause for the speakers. I don't know if any of them are even still here. I know Katie's gone. Is Mr. Cooper still here, Dennis? Checked out, maybe? Okay. Uh, let's run them down quick. So I, I was so impressed. Uh, and by the way, I've never been in 2,000 shows, never been. And I've seen some stuff, man. I have never been at a show that talked about underwear so much. <laughs> <laughs> and I feel bad. I've never broken my underwear. So I'm, I'm less than Katie. And uh, I have 14 pair of underwear. I'm only telling you that because I know Waleed's going to ask me. 14 pair. I loved his line yesterday about data, right, being so important. And some of that data is you got to get deeper into your customers' closets. I love that line. It says so much about relationships and getting to know people. Katie was amazing because um, here's this nice lady that set stamina and endurance records. And she was so gentle about how she talked about being one of the toughest things you can be, which is an astronaut. I don't know if you have an idea of how smart you have to be to be an astronaut. You've got to know a lot about a lot of topics. And she was just such an impressive woman. I enjoyed Mr. Cooper's program very much. He's not only a cancer survivor, ladies and gentlemen, he's a survivor in the speaking business, which may be more difficult. He's 81 years old. You see how he was getting around? And he was stepping so close to the edge of the stage, I was nervous for him. Like, better people than him have fallen off stages, Steven Tyler. Uh, Stephen Tyler's fallen off the stage multiple times, I think. Uh, Alpina was fabulous yesterday. Another person who's broken through in her business. What a role model for all of us to think outside the box and do things that people have never done before. To be the youngest, to be a female, to be a cultural icon like she is. I just found it so inspirational. We also have talent baked into the industry. Dave Menz is here today. I had Dave on my podcast many, many months ago, maybe during COVID. Uh, Dave and Wally, they're marketing geniuses, right? And you may not, and, and this, I say this with all respect, you may not like their style because marketing is very subjective. You may not like my style today, but that's not the point. The point is we have figured it out to some extent, and there's something that, that can be learned from that. You don't want to become the Dave, next Dave Menz or Waleed Cope or Michael Caruso. You want to be the best company that you can be, and trust me, and the best person you can be, and trust me when I tell you there is room to grow. And I'm going to help you with that in my talk. I'm going to give you practical solutions for making that happen. So Clean Laundry, uh, uh, the Coin Laundry Association, uh, is a proponent of clean laundry, and I've met nothing but what I call clean people this weekend. People that burn clean energy. It is very, very inspiring.